Saturday, President Donald Trump will hold rallies in two counties he narrowly lost to Hillary Clinton in 2016. Muskegon County, Michigan and Rock County, Wisconsin. But the head of the Democratic Party in Muskegon County says the county won't flip to the Republican column. 13 on your side, Lakeshore reporter John Mills has more on what Muskegon area Democrats will be doing Saturday afternoon just prior to the president's arrival. Muskegon County Democrats will be holding their own rally right here at Heritage Landing. It's a rally supporting candidates running in local races all the way up to the top of the ticket. In 2016, Muskegon County voters picked Hillary Clinton over Donald Trump by 1,177 votes. And Muskegon County Republicans believe they'll flip the county November 3rd. That's likely one reason President Trump will address supporters at the county airport Saturday. Trump is scheduled to speak at 5, then he'll quickly fly to a rally in Janesville, Wisconsin. In 2016, Rock County voters also chose Clinton in a close race. Bring your Biden signs, um, make your own signs to wave. In reaction to the president's visit, the Muskegon County Democratic Party will hold a rally here Saturday at 4. Muskegon County is going blue. Party Chair Jennifer Barnes takes issue with the president's campaign staff, describing his Muskegon rally as an event supporting law enforcement. I don't believe for one minute that he actually supports our law enforcement. Uh, the Dems here in Muskegon County do, and we want to go out and rally to make sure that our local law enforcement knows that we are behind them 100%. The president's rally is expected to draw a significant crowd. Barnes says there's lots of time before the election. We are not letting up. And she's still hopeful Biden or Harris will visit Muskegon County too. We've got to keep the momentum up and that's one way to do that. I don't want Democrats to sit back thinking, oh, the polls say that Biden's ahead. We don't really need to do anything. If he was to come here or even if Kamala Harris was to come here, that would help to encourage people that yes, we absolutely have to get out and vote. And attendees at both rallies are being asked by organizers to wear masks. In Muskegon County, John Mills, 13 on your side.